Today is World Food Day, and efforts to reduce hunger are being recognized right here in our community. Staff at Paul's Pantry in Green Bay says this past year has been their busiest on record, with more than 50,000 visits made to the pantry. New at 4, Emily Riley shows us how they hope World Food Day will bring extra attention to the growing need. World Food Day is recognized around the globe, but also sheds a light on the needs of our local community. And the need is rising. Greg Robbins from Paul's Pantry in Green Bay says just over the past year, the number of individuals needing help has increased tremendously. The number one thing that we hear from people is that, oh, my landlord, you know, is raising the rent, you know, $150 or $300 a month. The purpose of World Food Day is to call attention to the issue. Robin says, fortunately, community members have become more involved as the need has grown, leading to a boost in donations and more people stepping up to volunteer. 89-year-old Mavis Meyer has been volunteering at the pantry for nearly four decades. It's kind of wonderful. Uh, some of them want to talk because they need to, so I always listen. Brown County Executive Troy Streckenbach and Reverend James Nielsen also took part in Monday's ceremony at the pantry, proclaiming October 16th, 2023 as World Food Day in Brown County. Robin says he sees it as an important reminder. It's almost like New Year, New Year's Day for us. We recommit ourselves to the mission of making sure no one goes hungry. In Green Bay, Emily Riley, Action 2 News. And we have a link on our website at WBAY.com with more information on how you can help out Paul's Pantry and other food pantries in our viewing area.